Okay, request for a quickie tutorial on London Grammar's Stay Awake opening chords. Uh, I apologize for the cold, but uh, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and play it and then we'll break it down, all right? Nothing too fancy there, okay? So we start at the 11th fret, barring, in an E minor shape with your fingers at the 13th. Okay, then a bar chord at the 9th in an E shape, and drop that to the 7th. Come back to the 11th, to the 9th, to the 14th, then quickly drop to the 4th, barring in an E minor shape, 2nd in an E shape, then slide that up to the 9th, back to the 2nd, back to the 9th, to the 11th, back to the 9th, and then to the 14th bar, and then uh, I'm, I've got my middle finger on the G string, 15th fret, and my ring and pinky fingers on the D and G string at the uh, 16th fret. And I'm just pulling off my pinky there, just lightly brushing those strings. And then off you go into the song, right? Um, so I'm using flat wound strings on this 59 uh, Jazz Master, these Tomastic Infeld flat wound 12s. They're just a fabulous string. Never go out of tune, steady, and real nice. You can slide up and down them and you don't hear a bunch of, you know, of the, of the uh, noise going up and down the neck like you do with other kinds of strings, which sometimes is desirable, but uh, on this piece, not at all. Leave it to the very end to mess up. There you go. Cool song.